It is now August 28th, 12.16 a, or p.m. Sorry, New York time is a.m. here um, on the 29th. We are now at $3,047.28. Um, so we're still down just a little bit. I'm $19 in profit over here. I was thinking about taking out another order, but this is the American session. So I don't really like trading the American session because it's it's crazy. It seems like every time I trade the American session, I lose money. So, but, you know, that's all specific to, you know, how you trade, who you are, what you want to do. You know, and I mean, that's that's the whole thing about forex you can take all the advice and indicators and whatever you want to do but uh, the bottom line is how how you personally trade you need to master that if you jump around and try this and try that and don't settle on anything you'll always lose money so anyways I'm kind of a risky trader I didn't <laughs> um, but uh, you you can't gain unless you risk you know that's the bottom line that's the only way so the best way to do that is to refine your system so you have more wins and losses and if you've got more wins and losses then you will come out ahead so anyways you gotta know where to cut your losses because I had one here for eighty dollars you notice it's it's not red right there but it's eighty dollars and fifty five cents um, I cut my losses on that one and later I realized I should have just hung in there but you know it is what it is this one here hit a stop loss at $53 um, but that's it those are the two losses so one was a stop loss and one I took uh, the rest of it's been profit but I am still $27 down on the month so far but like I said, I lost the internet. I'm just now getting back into this. So that's the thing. You, you can't just jump into this, even if you know what you're doing. You got to get back into the market and see where the market's going and, and know that stuff. I don't pay attention to the news. Um, my secret strategy is actually in the codex of money. So right now, yeah, um, that's, that's the bottom line. These this program goes with that codex of money and I like to look at profits not pips and if you look at my I think it's video 24 um, you will see how I count pips I go by what this thing actually says so like say I want to measure this candle right here you know to me that's 547 pips Okay, but everybody says, oh, well, there's an imaginary decimal point in there, so it's only 54.7 pips. Really? No, because if you put an imaginary decimal point into something that's supposed to be, this is the supposed to be the uh, world's leading 4X um, chart setup, whatever program. So, uh, no. Would they forget to leave it out? No, it changes the number completely if you put an imaginary decimal point in there. So, anyways, that's what I believe. And, uh, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. Anyways, so we are down just a few dollars from where I started, but here it is right here. So, this will take profit. And, um, let's see, I'm on the wrong one here. Euro Australian dollar. Where you at? There it is. Yeah. It's going to take profit. I got it magnified here. Only look at it like that. So, anyways, that's it for this video. And stay tuned for more. Okay, here we go. This is a second part of video 43. And you just come from the first part. So, I had a trade out and I took profit on that trade it is now um, Sunday August 30th uh, 639 a.m. in the morning uh, New York time so anyways I'm just now getting ready to report this I've known about this since it happened but 
Uh, you can see the account history here. Green is profit, red is loss. Um, let's see, 33 in profit, 53 in loss. Um, I stated in the previous part, I uh, took that $80 loss when I probably shouldn't have, but I got some profit here, $32, $74, $42. So now we're $47 in profit on the week. I started, I think it was Tuesday or Wednesday. So it took a couple of days and come out $47 in profit. So we'll see what happens next week. I wanted to make this video. Like I said, it's it's Sunday morning in the United States, New York time right now, 6.30, actually 6.40 now. Um, but anyways, I'm going to get this uploaded and check out my code and money, a lot of my strategies in there. Don't forget to visit the Best Forex Strategies website. And I don't charge a fortune to teach how to do this. It's simple. Keep it simple and that's you know kind of my model and uh, uh, profits not pips I don't count pips really I count profits so the object of the game is to be ahead more than you're behind and if you know how to do it right then uh, you can profit so check it out in the description below and have a good day.